ready? Yeah, I'm ready, Wyatt. That's when you take the ball. Hey, age before beauty. Wait a second. This is Green Bay at Chicago, the black and blue division. Blood and guts on Halloween night. There's only one guy to kick off this game. Thanks for the handoff, Joe. But I think a scream pass would be better. Hey, team, are you ready for some football? <laughs> of the Midway, the Chicago Bears. The creatures from the north, the Green Bay Packers. For years, they have been at each other's throats, looking to extract that pound of flesh. He stands six foot five, the Packers' predator, a quarterback carnivore, defensive end, Reggie White. The Packers and the Bears are the oldest rivalry in, in the league. Uh, you, you go, you, you're going to see some good football. Uh, it's, uh, it's a division game. It's a, it's a big game on both sides. So you know there's going to be a lot of head knocking and head cracking. coming on tonight. City, and it is windy, and it is raining at Soldier Field, where tonight the Green Bay Packers take on the Chicago Bears on Halloween Eve in the longest continuous rivalry in the National Football League's history, the 147th time they've met. Hello again, everyone. I'm Frank Gifford with Al Michaels and Dan Deardorf. And guys, we've got some weather. This, uh, this is about as bad as I've seen it in a long time. I don't know whether we should have dressed up as the three stooges or the three frozen turkeys tonight. Woo, it's brutal. Some people think we're the three blind mice. And tonight, I think it's the three drowned rats. Well, these Packers and Bears are going to have to put this all behind them. The wind blowing them back, gusting up to 45 miles per hour. Big game here in the NFC Central Division. The Minnesota Vikings lead the division. They are 6-2. and two. The Bears coming in tonight at 4-3. and three. They need to win tonight to stay within one of the Minnesota Vikings. And meanwhile, the Green Bay Packers, a team many thought would win this division, preseason favorites to do so are three and four if they lose another one tonight they drop three back out and they can forget about the division championship and they talk playoffs they'll be talking wild card and three of those losses have been excruciating including one in overtime Frank this was supposed to be the breakout year they've been nine and seven in each of Mike Holmgren's first two seasons defensively they've been playing extremely well they're giving up less than 14 points again led by the great Reggie White but offensively they are led by their quarterback Brett Favre he will start tonight he suffered a bruised hip and missed three quarters of the Minnesota game but he's been erratic and inconsistent. He has to step it up for Green Bay to step it up and finish with a flourish in the second half of the season. Tonight they come into Chicago, and Dan, teams love to play Monday night games at home, but I'm not sure about these guys. Well, the Bears say they love to play on Monday night, Al, but I, I don't know why. They've played Monday night football 36 times and only won 12 of those games, and that includes the fact that they have lost their last six consecutive games. Now, here's the story for Chicago, and it's real simple. 